Well guys, I just caught this crappie a while ago and uh, he, I was gonna show you the difference between a black and white crappie. You see how he's got a spotty pattern? His pattern is spotty. Well, a white crappie, he's got these lines that run across them, vertical lines. And a white crappie has five to six of these uh, pokey fins up here on top. On this one, there's seven to eight. There's one, two, th three, four, five, six, seven on this, this crappie here. But they can have seven to eight on a black crappie, five to six on a, on a white crappie. Very easy way to tell them apart. A white crappie is also, usually they're a little longer and the black crappie are short and round, more like a football style, almost on average, you know. But anyway, I wanted to show you the difference and hopefully I'll catch a white crappie and show you that too here in just a minute. There he is. What we got here? Oh, we got crappie. Come on, baby. I hope it's a white crappie. Check it out. Oh, yeah, it is. Nice. Oh yeah, we got a white crappie. He's a good one. Yeah, see the mouth on that white crappie? He's a lot bigger and he's a lot longer looking than that black crappie. And here's them stripes I was talking about right there. And on the dorsal fins, you got one, two, three, four, five. He's got five. Five to six on a white crappie, seven to eight on a black crappie. But yeah, that's... They look a lot similar. They both got that greenish color in, when they're out in the uh, deep water in these lakes. But that's how you tell them really distinct. It, mainly the fins and then these lines. But anyway, that's a good one. We'll take him. There he is. Little old crappie. He's a little guy. <laughs> but we found one. <laughs> we knew y'all was in here. See, we got on that little measurement thing there. He's just under nine inches. He's about eight and three quarters. A little white crappie. All right. Later. There he is. Oh, we found a crappie. We found one. I don't know if he's big enough. <laughs> Old Jig and Bobber got him. Well, jig and bobber and a minnow. Yeah, he's a little guy. I don't think he's big enough. Easy there, buddy. Well, he's already back in the water. <laughs> Something over there. What we got here? A little bass. No, it's a, it's a little crappie. <laughs> a little tiny dude. I mean tiny. Seven incher. Yep. Little white crappie. Later. There she goes. Is that a gar or is that a crappie? I'm not sure yet. That's a pretty good fish. Oh, that's a, that's a drum. He's a pretty good one. Easy there, buddy. Just going in the net. I'm going to turn you loose. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's a pretty good size one. These old guys are pretty. Easy. Easy. There you go. He's a, he's a pretty good one. Let me see how long he is. I hadn't measured one of these in a while. Yeah, 17 and a quarter. They got a pretty silvery color to them. A kind of bluish purple, rainbow color. But if you're going to handle these guys, go through that gill plate. Be careful. And then grab them right through the mouth right there. Because he will flip. You can't just lip these like a regular fish. With, you know, you might be able to if you got a good strong grip, but I never can, so I just pinch them right through there like that. But there's a good one. Uh oh, there we go. Oh, we got another gar. Mm-hmm. You got hooked too, didn't you? Yeah, you did. Well, thank you very much. 
you just had to get hooked he's down in there a little bit i'm kind of i'm nervous of this one <laughs> well if you got to do this guys get you a towel and just grab him by, around his mouth actually because them teeth he won't go nowhere but but look at them teeth he's mean looking open that mouth up a little bit There we go. We got our lure back. Now we got to do is grab this rag and just shake him off. Sweat bee. I don't know if you guys know it, but you see how the sweat bees, they curve up so they can get their stinger right up against you. So if you touch them, they sting you. And they hurt. It's like a bee sting. But uh, while he's getting that salt and stuff, you slap him or touch him, he'll get you. But let me show you how to get rid of these guys. Just get your finger and thumb and pinch them. Roll them. Throw them in the water for bait, uh, fish bait. <laughs> there he is. Oh, what we got here? Is that a gar? It's got to be fast. Oh, it was a drum. <laughs> I was thinking, thinking that was another gar. Oh. Oh, yeah. Pretty beat up little drum. He's all right. Later. There we go. What we got here? Wow. Fighting fish. Oh, it's a car. <laughs> he does the fighter. Yeah. There you go. That's what I wanted you to let go. 